When our plans are destroyed and ruined, why do we feel as if Allah is targeting us? Or as if Allah has abandoned us? Or as if Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala doesn't care about us? Or as if Allah doesn't have mercy upon us? The Prophet says, Inna Allah yu'ti hadhi dunya liman yuhib wa liman la yuhib wa la yu'ti al-akhira illa liman yuhib. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gives this dunya to the ones that he loves and the one that he doesn't love. But he only gives the akhirah to, to those he loves. So if you've been going through hardship, if you've been going through a financial loss, struggle, emotional, psychological, social, any type of pain, any type of suffering, and it's been going on for a long time, you're not alone. You're not the only one, and that's not strange. This is how life is meant to be. Not because Allah loves humans to suffer, but because فَإِنَّ مَعَ الْعُسْرِ يُسْرَى إِنَّ مَعَ الْعُسْرِ يُسْرَى Indeed, with every hardship there is ease. With every hardship there is ease, Allah says. So how do, we go, how do we deal with all of those hardships and calamities? Some people have been suffering for 10 years, some people for 20, some people for 50 years. They've been calling upon Allah to remove some kind of a predicament or hardship and Allah hasn't removed it yet. Not because Allah doesn't care, but maybe Allah wants to elevate them. The Prophet says in the hadith, Inna Allah la yuhiyyu li ahadikum fil jannati manzilatan aliyya la yabluguha bi'amalihi fayabtaliyya liyasbir fayubalighu iyyah aw kama qala alayhi salatu wassalam that Allah has a place for one of you in paradise, a high place and the person doesn't do enough to get it the person doesn't is not, a, is not devout enough to do it but Allah wants them to get there. So Allah sends hardships and pain and suffering on the way of this person. So this person responds with patience and with this patience, Allah elevates this person to that level. Anywhere you go, any side you sleep on, any ceiling you're under, you are well taken care of. There's no mistakes in your life. There's nothing random that ever happened to you in your life. Everything was written 50,000 years before the creation of the heavens and the earth. And this is a source of relief because the one who wrote that down is the most merciful, the most wise, the just. It's a source of relief.